Revelio. Der Froschchor. Frogwire. Here purge the slimy yet symphonic uh, frogs that comprise the Hogwarts Frogwire. These magical amphibians can sing in six part harmony and hold the pitch better than most humans. Oh my god. <laughs> Damn it, it's a level up. He was. <laughs> it looked like he was laughing at me. He was like, yeah, you can't open it. Jeez, where are we going? Let me open. Um. Repair it. No, not. Also enough, there's just um just a bell. Jesus Christ man. What? No! What? Oh Oh god Okay, that's, um, makes a lot of funny noises, but it's not having the effect that I wanted to. Yeah! All right, we'll get back to here and, and, um, we will look further into the things upstairs with the, <laughs> just down here. Oh God. We will do that, but right now I can't do anything. There's also something. There's a, uh, something here. Uh, where is this? I just. Rebellion. There's a chest. Oh god. Where am I? All right. This is just. Urn of Ashes. This particular urn is rumored to have once borne the inscription Pioneer and Dragon Taming should not have started with the Hungarian Horntail. <laughs> okay. Hello, ghost. Meow. <gasps> what is this beautiful thing? Sleeping Dragon Statue. The Hogwarts model Draco. Uh, blah, blah, blah. Never take a Never take a look. Fortunately, this particular sleeping dragon is made of stone and will never awaken. It may be tickled to absolutely no effect. Oh, it's so cute. Ah! Hello. Natty, I hope I haven't kept you waiting long. I mean, I Not was just all. running around to Professor three Weasley different places to before to talking to you. You must be eager to have your own things again. And to see the village. I've been looking forward to it. Good. Shall we set off? I intend to give you a first-rate Hogsmeade experience. That's not Hogsmeade. Jesus is starting I to run. I'm glad Professor Weasley asked me to accompany you. Really? Yes. I had Revelio. to extend an invitation to you myself. To I thought you might enjoy a better be in the village. <laughs> the timing of Professor Weasley's owl was perfect. Ah, oh, Quidditch. We we will have I enough tell time you how nice to, it is to look breathe around. fresh air after being cooped up in ancient rooms. Hmm. Grave mistake to take it as an elective class, believe me. Okay, good to know. I believe you. Though I suppose you would not really call it elective when your mother was the one who elected that you take it. There are sheep. Hogsmeade is beautiful this time of year. Everyone will tell you to visit at Christmas. But that's one of the few times of year I would rather be indoors. 
<laughs> not much for the cold, are you? Oh, I do not mind the cold so much, but it has taken some getting used to. Mm. I did not grow up around snow. Oh, wait, over here. I often spot lacewing flies in this area. Oh? What's so special about them? They are interesting to look at. But if you stew them, you can also use them in potion making. Oopsie, sorry. Sorry, I'm just looking around. Just being mesmerized Look, a bit. From the forbidden forest. Hippogriffs. Where? I wonder if something startled them. I heard rumors that hippogriffs had been spotted nearby. Oh, there. <laughs> you think Poppy's already seen the hippogriffs? Absolutely. Likely already named them too. Prance Hoof and Sugarfoot. Those are great names. I, I don't see a problem with those at all. That's the forbidden forest on the left. It's off limits to students, as the name implies. Why is it off limits? The professors claim it is too dangerous. I think that calling it forbidden only makes it more alluring. Ah, there's Hogsmeade over the crest. Pass that ruin. What does it say? Caution. Centaurs. This area has been declared danger by Minister of Magic. It's actually quite interesting how it's the Forbidden Forest right next to us. Wow. 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 It's so beautiful. I... In the first year, they have to go to the Forbidden Forest, even though they are, they're being told, yeah, it's super dangerous, so you shouldn't go there, but then they're being sent in there for... Because they did bad thing. Oh! I didn't do that. I would spend all of my time exploring if I could. Ha <laughs> ha I was surprised when Professor Weasley mentioned that you knew the area, since you're relatively new here. She said that? Hmm. She knows more about me than I had thought. I will say, while I certainly learn a great deal in class, much can be gleaned outside of the castle walls. Revelio. How are you settling in? I remember the weeks that followed my arrival feeling quite strange. Everything Lake. Is so new and unfamiliar. I'm getting used to things. What about you? Do you finally feel settled? I still miss it. But it is beautiful here too. And getting out of the castle and exploring helped me to adjust quite a bit. Hogwarts has become something of a home now, I would say. Hopefully yeah, I'm totally listening. Sorry. I was a bit distracted. I saw something and I was like, I think I can gather that cat. From her side, at least. Kitty kid. Why? Is there no, like, oh, you petted nine out of these many cats that exist in Hogwarts? Leaping toadstool caps. I will get my toadstool caps, and if it's the last thing I ever do. 
Sorry. Mr. Moon! He is the Hogwarts caretaker. Oh, that, that's why he looks so special. Hello, I was Mr. wondering. Moon. Have you met our new fifth year? Pleasure. Um, Pleasure. Turn back, Miss on I. Uh, turn and run. Okay. Everything all right, sir? Oh, it looked right at me. Eyes big as saucers. What did Mr. Moon? Jemmy, guys, Dougley and Arian. Mm, terrifying. I shall be at the castle. Ah, oh, that's what that thing on the cube is. Oh, good luck. A Debbie, guys. I think he had too much fun in the village. I will say that I have never seen him in such a state. That's actually cool, having your book. Um, Akio! Having your book. And you're there is in front of your face of the walls, not just while walking. I would love I to be able to, to do that, but using like. both hands to Rules carry stuff. What they are about goblins and such, it might be nice to have a friend with you. I'll keep that in mind, Natty. Thank you. Hogs meat. Wow! 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 And here we are. It is hard to know where to start. The three broomsticks is the best hey, of butter. Kitty cat. And you can get any sweet you can imagine at Honey Dukes. Mm -hmm. I could not choose a favorite shop here. It changes with every visit. Tuh. I can tell you that you are certain to find everything you need in Hogsmeade. People just talking. Blah, 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 blah. Professor Weasley said that you need to get potion recipes, spellcraft, some seeds, and... A new wand. Of course! You will enjoy Mr. Ollivander, and I am keen to see what you will do with a wand of your own. You should be able to collect everything you need and still have time to explore a little as well. Experience Hogsmeade at your own pace. We can meet up in the town circle when you are finished. Enjoy yourself. I will see you soon. Hogsmeade Village is brimming with different sites, shops, and other points of interest that you can navigate using your Fields Guys map. Right. Oh gosh darn, that's a lot. Hogsmeade shows shops and points of interest. Uh huh. Why are the fireworks? You can track any of these. Oops, press blech. Alright, we're gonna get to Ollivanders first because. Hell yeah, it's like right around the corner too. Rebellion. Ollivander's Wand Shop. Wands of a variety of woods and all manner of flexibility, each possessing one of three uh, magical cores. Choose their owners in this cozy, cluttered shop run by the amiable and knowledgeable Gerbold Ollivander. In the profession of wandcraft since 382 BC, the Ollivander family are considered the best wand makers in Britain, if not the world. My gears are full! I'll be right with. Ah, it's you. Um, just a moment, please. Sure. Uh, mm. Hello, sir. I'm looking for... For a new wand, yes. It's about time. Yes, uh, about time? Well, you're our new fifth-year student, are you not? Oh, well, yes. Saying, of course you are. Gerbold Ollivander's the name. But of course, you'll have heard of the Ollivanders, I'm sure. Sure, I just read about you before you. entering. It's a pleasure to meet you, truly. What do you know? Let's find you the perfect one, shall we? I still wonder what what exactly our story is like. Um, our parents, are we full blood witches, uh, full blood witch or not, or do we have muggle parents, or how does this work? You might do. Here, give this one a try. 
Okay. Well, go ahead, swish. Du musst ihn schwingen. Hm. How odd. Uh, once more, come on, really swish it. All right, dude. This doesn't seem correct. Yeah. Yeah, that's not the well, one, man. This isn't man. good match at all, is it? <laughs> uh, um, we'll find you something not to worry. Hmm. No, not you. Uh, uh, hmm. Perhaps. Yes. A rare wood, thirteen and three quarter inches, dragon heart string. Mm -hmm. Let's give this one a try. All right, if you say so. Oh God! Oh, what happened? Looks like it's back to the shelf for you. This one was like, I'm not having it. This is proving to be trickier than I had anticipated. No. How perplexing. Um, where are you? Perhaps you? Uh, ah, there you are. Yes. I think you might be the one. Here. Take it. All right. Oh, I can finalize my wand. That's so cute. <laughs> finalize wand. Wand style. Oh my god. All right. Oh god. I can make my own wand. How intriguing. That one maybe. How honey intriguing. Wand. Spirals interesting. Soft spiral. Oh, that one's pretty. Curious indeed. Uh, well, let's 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 look. Wood type walnut. What does that change? I don't even know half of these names. Acacia, Alder. What, what the fuck is an Alder? Apfel, Ash. Curious indeed. Ash is cool. Aspen, Beech, Blackthorn, Black Walnut, Cheddar. Cheese, cherry, chestnut, cypress, dogwood, what the How heck, intriguing. ebony, elder, elm, English oak, fear, hawthorn, hazel, holly, hazel, it's hazel, I know, hornbeam, curious indeed, red oak sounds cool, silver lime, silver lime sounds cool, silver lime, vine, walnut, I don't know, man, why is it in inches? Reasonable, supple, supple, like swishy, surprisingly swishy, quite flexible, quite bendy. I have no idea what it means. A unicorn, eh? the feather of a phoenix, is oh, so cool of the one capable of doing great range of magic, known for producing consistent magic. Cool of one, powerful magic. Mmm, my god. I don't know if I'm happy with this Curious one. Indeed. I mean, I thought the wand chooses the wizard. <laughs> Not the other way around. I don't like that wand. No, I don't like it one bit, How sir. How intriguing. I guess consistency fits me the most, but I like powerful too. I like a wide range too, but eh, I'm not the person who uses the f so many different spells. So like... But like I know it's gonna be consistent because I'm awesome. I'm gonna take a the dragon. dragon. Heartstring wand is most powerful, and learns quickly. Oh, what does it say here? Nothing. Okay, cool. Yeah, silver lime during our surprising switch. That's that's my wand right there. What do you think? I think it looks like a stick. Extraordinary. <laughs> another wand, another beginning of a bright and magical future. <laughs> now, how did that feel? Good. Different. I sensed a sort of surge of some kind. A match. 
Your connection seemed particularly powerful. The right wand will learn from you, just as you learn from it. I'm eager to try it out. I would imagine so. A wand with a dragon heartstring core is capable of dazzling magic. And the bond between you and your wand should only grow stronger. Do not be surprised at your new wand's ability to perceive your intentions, particularly in a moment of need. That God, I love that. Mr. Ollivander. I'll let you get to it. Do come and see me again, if ever I can be of further assistance. I assume you can change the wand? I don't know. I got stuck. Revelio. Accio. You're mine. Hello. Oh, come in. Come in. Welcome to Madame Snelling's Tress Emporium. <laughs> I'm sure I've no need to introduce myself. Uh. You call me Snelly. Oh, Snelly. Why aren't you studying to be an aura? But I showed them. They're stuck in the dust at the Ministry, and I'm here, thriving. Absolutely thriving. Good. Look at you. Look at you. I can certainly see why you paid me a visit. Hey. Looking for a change, are we? Uh, change, why, why not, not? I say. What sort of change? Some are going for that muggle with consumption sort of death becomes me allure. But you won't find uh... poisons here. No need for chloride of lime or ammonia when you have magic. Why don't you spend a moment choosing how you'd like to look? You can change your hair too if you'd like. Okay, she was talking about hair dye. May I see your what services? What services do you offer? Can I sell what stuff? You might be interested in? Apparently not. Let's go with that one. Woo! Oh, we're matching. Okay, I can't sell stuff here. Revelio. Anything of interest? There's just a chest here that's suppressing. Is that a dodo? What is happening here? <gasps> you okay, man? I told you not to go down that path. Miss Peck from Brood and Peck said a customer lost a Dirichul around here. I know we're not supposed to go down there. I just thought... You could have got us in a lot of trouble. I'm very sorry, Father. Only she said I might earn a reward. Oh, it's Instead, gone. I just wasted our time. There you are! Ha! Huh. Finally! I'll have enough of that wind wisp. Oh. Ah, well, not meant to be. Also, I may have knocked over a dustbin back there. Never mind, I'll fix it. <laughs> as always. <laughs> <laughs> <You're>, eh. <laughs> you did say nothing. Hi, kitty. What is that? Hooray! Well, this is the um, honeydews. The honig top. <laughs> Rebellion. Fizzing Wisbees. These delicious sweets, rumored to contain bil billywig stings, are small sherbet balls that, when consumed, will levitate one a few inches off the ground. Yeah, we already ate those a few times already. So, that's why we can. Oh, you're just eating it, alright. Sure, just just eat stuff. <laughs> okay, they all do the same. I thought maybe it would change to an elephant and stuff. Whoa. What is happening? This... This was strange. 
I don't know how to react to that. Well, that's a nice shop. That's a nice how do you do. I can't sell anything in here either. Can I sell stuff at yours? God damn it! It constantly tells me vendors and hawksmeats, but like, where? Where? You liar! Ah. Uh, um. Said, serried uh, vents, precarious cauldrons. This precariously stacked set of cauldrons outside of, outside the set of room that advertises the shop's wares. War wares. It should be noted that stacking cauldrons is in this fashion. While admittedly eye-catching, it is ill-advised for anyone wishing to brew a bow sheet of any intended effect. I couldn't read that for the life of me. I'm so sorry. An inquiring mind. Hi. Sir, I'm here for the spellcrafts, Professor Weasley ordered. Matilda's student. I thought I might be seeing you soon. I am the proprietor here. Thomas Brown. I take it you've had a conjuring lesson then. I'm afraid I haven't. Yeah, right. I was thinking, like, did I? I'm not sure about that. It is magic at its purest. Creating something out of nothing. Of course, it is not without complexity, but that is where my spellcrafts come in. Stay the course, and you could soon impress even Professor Weasley. That sounds that like it would suck. To, Mr. Brown. Like the whole I thing, not idea. the impressing part, but like and I, I don't think I want. It. I will like spellcrafts it. Spellcrafts are incredibly useful for conjuring unique items like custom pieces of furniture or decoration. I don't but care about stuff like Professor that at all. For now, let's get the spellcrafts you need. A potting table and a <sighs> fashion station. Yes? I believe yes, so. Sure. Good. Nothing like being So the blueprints, basically. Ingredients and brew what you want, when you want. Let's have a look. Brewing my own Let's look at what we have, shall we? Uh... Should I, what potting table with a small pot spellcraft? Potting table, small pot. Use it. Okay. And this. What is going on? Temporary the beast feeder. Okay. If you're interested, feel free to take a look around at the rest of my inventory. I can sell this prefect vest uniform. Since when do I have a? Since when am I a prefect? I will just sell them all because they don't have the highest level. Because what am I supposed to do with them? Right? Right. Get rid of it all except the first two things. I can't get rid of it right now. I just can't get it. Oh! Wow. Rebellion. It's magic. Something is flying around. Then. Oh. Akio. Damn it. So Stop it. <laughs> nah. Hallelujah. We got a deluxe cloak. What in heaven's name just happened? Something just flew in and disappeared. Wow. Well, <laughs> dang. Beautiful. Pardon me, sir. Oh, thank goodness. When I heard the bell, I thought you were Miss La Wang. La Wang? Oh, she deigns to come here. Though, I don't believe I've seen your face here before, either. Pippin. It's my first time in Hogsmeade, actually. Why well, don't know that really? name? Well, Parry Pippin at your service. And this is J. Pippin's Potions. Potions for all ailments. <laughs> You'll have read it on the sign, of course, but Grandfather always made me say it in full. Tch. How may I help you today? 
Professor Weasley sent me to collect some recipes. I'm new at Hogwarts. You're the student she sent the owl about. I set your things aside immediately. I suspected if you're anything like I was at your age, you'd want your potion. I have a question. If you don't have any That's money when you come here at this making, point, like because I maybe you're like, I'm not looking so around Hogwarts and free, so on. Huh? You're just like going, not doing anything. Do you have enough money to buy stuff? Just powerful. They can heal, destroy, protect. You'll discover all of this soon enough. Mm -hmm. As it's your first time in, I should mention that it's not just potion recipes I sell. I also offer ready-made drafts for all manner of uses. And I unveil new ones from time to time. Pop in when you can so you don't uh, miss out on anything. Hmm? But for now, let's get you those recipes, shall we? Okay. What can I do for you today? I mean, I'm not that... The Feel free push. to take a look at the rest of my inventory. Or come back another time if you're in a rush today. The drinker's spell cooldowns. A powerful damage potion. Uh, makes the drinker practically invisible. I will not buy anything for now because, like, we don't know how the fights and we're not are gonna be. I can swim. Press R. I didn't know I can swim. Ugh. I thought I'd die. But no, I can swim. That's magical. That's the most magical thing about this game. I can swim. Oh, a <laughs> door opens. I didn't have to jump over it. Sheep? Well, hello there. How do you even open that door? Pardon me, sir. I'm here for the seeds Professor Weasley arranged for me to collect. Oh, the Dittany for the new fifth year. <laughs> I take it that's you then. Merlin's well. Starting Hogwarts is a fifth year. You must be positively reeling from it all. Not at all. Uh, I'm choosing to see it all as one big adventure. Overwhelming a bit, oh, it's, but it's kind of neat. Things as they come. Name's Timothy Teasdale, by the way, and this is my shop, the Magic Neep. Neep. I keep the cart out here because I like a good chat. Can't very well be in the thick of things if I'm hidden away inside now, can I? I suppose. Yeah. In addition to seeds, I have plenty of plants. Grow everything myself. My speciality is potion ingredients. Even Pippin purchases from me. But what say we get you a packet of Dittany seeds? Dittany. Let me get. Sure. You're after something fresh. Oh, it's cost zero. Well, plenty of ingredients to pique your interest, I'd wager. I'll just well, leave. That's everything. It. Better go and find Natty. Yeah, I just. I won't. 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 For now. But I will be back. Repairer. Let me also. Well, that didn't help. It's just so unimpressed. <laughs> Chess is like, yeah, now what? <laughs> I haven't figured Rebellion. out what to do with them yet. Rebellion. I knew it. Abandoned shop. The pro creator of this abandoned shop is said to have used a shrinking charm to aid in storing his inventory. However, slight miscalculation ended up for all intents and purposes, vanishing it. Damn it! He thought like, aha, I'm doing smart, and then... That's why you have to do a trial of it first, man. Lumos. Where the flying heck is that supposed to be? It's just forest. Stop the page, just... Stop me there. this Revelio. that's a cool house though like built into the Accio. I can see you come here wait th those are the two thingies yes Lumos. 
Thank God they're close by. Nice. Lumos. Yups. Uh, there we go. There's a page there too. Revelio. The dogweed and death cap tree. This large tree with winding branches supports the shop dogweed and death cap. Beautiful. Be hello. at peace. Oh, hello. Oh, so oh, hello. <laughs> I was just scolding some of the plants for spitting and nipping. Mm. I suppose it's my own fault for putting more than four to a tray. By the way, Beatrice Green is the name, but you may address me as Madam Green. Okay. Welcome to Dogweed and Death Cap. Oh, he mind you don't knock the mandrakes. Oh, okay. It wasn't the constant demand for antidotes. I wouldn't need to stock so many of the little deers. <laughs> Except, of course, for curses. And, well, if you've been petrified, then obviously you've come to the right place. <laughs> mm -hmm. Mind you don't knock the mandrakes. Oh, if there's an uprooting, you'll be the next one to drop dead, and I'm in no mood for a clear-up. Okay. I got it. Miss Sewers. Are you saying someone died here? Someone died here? Aye. Fortunate, really, that it was Fortunate. just one. Oh, okay. How may I help you today? I think I'll just have a look around for now. Very well. Let me know if you see anything you like. Uh, may I see you as? What do you have for sale? Well, what say we show you some of what's available? Chinese medium parts. Mandrakes, venomous tentacula, a thousand, damn son. I could get the mandrake because that's the only one I know. Yeah, why not? We got, we got, we came all the way here. So why not? All right, let's go activate the flu leaf. Oops. And... See where life takes it, and then we will continue with the main quest. Ta! <laughs> Just destroying these people's livelihood. Does it get any more cozy than Hogsmeade? I don't know. <laughs> Aha. Well, thank you. Where is it? This. Jesus. Can't be so hard. Over here. Wait. Hold on. Revelio. Uh, the Hengist of Woodcroft. Uh, the statue of Hufflepuff Hengist is of wood. Is of Woodcroft. Yes, of Woodcroft. Believed to be the founder of the village of Hogsmeade after having been driven from his home by Muggle persecutors. Oh. There it is. Oh. Yay! Are we? Oh, you know, doing this and that. Okay, that's the chest over there. And now we're gonna get the other Foofy while we're at it, so we can always return. My Wi-Fi connection got lost. I mean, it doesn't bother me. Well, it totally does because the audio is fucked up in my ear now. Give me a second. All right, everything's okay again. That was strange. What are you up to now? I don't know yet. Potato. That was the wrong button. Lumos. I just wanted. To... Okay. Um. A big tree and two lanterns. And like... Sometimes it seems all roads lead to Hogsmeade. <laughs> okay, sure. If you wonder why sometimes I don't talk and it seems kind of abrupt, it's because my watch, I have a clock in my room, just starts to bimble bam 
And I don't want to have it in recording and if I speak it will hear it in the background so I stop speaking so it's not in there anymore. Because I can easily just cut my microphone out of the final product. What the heck? I feel like we're leaving the area where it, where it is so... I'll go back and try to check it one more time. Oh, there it is. Lumos. Look, I'm I'm great. I knew that. I just don't know where the mirror is anymore. There it is. I found it. God, I'm good at this. <laughs> uh, luck is with the dumb. Hogs meet. Here I come. <laughs> Why am I saying that? Just because I'm outside. The tat. Well, I think we can just continue with the main line. Oh, wait a second. Before we do that, I'm gonna... Get the rewards. Rebellion. Hey, yeah. Gladrax Mannequin. Unlike the enchanted mannequins favored by students for dueling practice, the mannequins at Gladrax serve only as a means to display the latest in wizarding fashion. Hello? I want to sell stuff. Uh, hello? <laughs> Why can I not interact with him? Somebody help. Scriven Shaft Cats. These cats seem to stay close to Scriven Shaft's quill shop. Perhaps it's the feather quills that entice them. Or perhaps it's the treats the owner often leaves for them. I like how just... How cats... I like the... Are just pets just... Like in a muggle world. They're not even enchanted cats. They're just cats. But they still exist here. Whereas I don't think I have seen a normal dog. <laughs> Does that just mean cats are magical creatures? Hello! <laughs> ah, I have everything. I see what you meant about not being able to pick a favorite shop. <laughs> we should walk around a bit more. Perhaps today is the day I finally pick one. Oi, what's now? What was going on? Oh, sh shoot. What the hell? Oh, it has this dark energy floaty flowing around it. God, we're so good. Draw it away from the building. Away from the building. Jesus. Isn't it magical how nothing got destroyed? I just said it. Okay. I had to check the controller where it was. Oops. Us. Are we weakening him at all? Keep at it. We have to let him. I don't do anything. Oh my god! Wow! Ancient magic throw? What is happening? What was that? I don't know. I was trying to beat him at his own game. I like it. Do more of it. Look, he's faltering. Took him long enough. We need to make sure he stays that way. Stupid. Hiya! L1 R2 invoke ancient magic. Hop! Oh. Whoa! Oopsies! I think I may have just killed a man. A woman. I don't know what gender that troll or ogre was. A second troll? Did you two take on a fully grown troll? Why is she standing like this? It's like nothing so. happened. Like, Hello! It's all a bit of a blur, to be honest. Merlin's beard. Are you all right? Honestly, we yes. We were glad to help. It I was so much fun. I want to do it more. 
nerve like that. The makings of an aura, if you ask me. Not if you become evil at the end of this. Perhaps the two of you wouldn't mind helping me put a few things back to where they were. Of course, officer. Singer. Officer Singer. And thank you, again. <sighs> that was fun. And she gone.